Hello. Okay, Assalamualaikum and good evening to all my students of MEC 101. Okay, now for this video, I will explain a little bit about the assignment 2 that you have to compete in a group. Uh, a group must be not be uh, more than 5 persons per group. Okay, so uh, I have already uploaded a PDF file of the assignment instructions here in our Google class uh, Google Classroom group so make sure you check it out okay um, so this assignment will contribute to 20% of your total marks uh, where 10% is coming from the reports and another 10% is from the PowerPoint presentation okay the deadline uh, you must be, uh, submit to me uh, not after 20 January so the final date is on the 20 uh, January 2021 which is the Friday okay make sure you submit the report in PDF format and the presentation uh, presentation should be in the PowerPoint format okay okay uh, let's open the PDF file the assignment instruction Okay, so this is the uh, assignment instruction, assignment 2. Okay, uh, let's read about the course outcome. So in the end of this assignment, all of you should have the ability to collectively undertake and complete assignment project in a small group of the 3 to 5 members. So uh, I recommend you to form a group of no more than 5 persons. So uh, maybe three or four or five is okay okay uh, the other the other outcome is to demonstrate effective communication on well-defined engineering activities with the engineers and society at large okay so the title of our assignment too is to redesign household furniture so <coughs> so uh, in your group you have to discuss with your group members uh, you have to choose a type of uh, furniture in your house and then you have to redesign it okay uh, so you are required to redesign the furniture in order to improve its function or design based on your engineering knowledge creativity and additional functionality of the furniture okay this task contains two main parts uh, this is what I mentioned earlier the report contribute to 10% the PowerPoint presentation uh, contribute to another 10% so redesign the household furniture give presentation in the class and write the report of the project so uh, I think the PowerPoint presentation you have to record the video okay and then you have to submit to me the PowerPoint file in PowerPoint format and also the video of your presentation uh, that is your option you can upload it uh, via the YouTube or so you can uh, upload it into your Google Drive or any other cloud system and then share the links to our Google Classroom okay the report format uh, you must obey or oblique the format which is uh, uh, stated in our guideline here the cover page must have the UITM's logo project title name and ID okay uh, name and ID lead the first names of your name list uh, should be the leader of the group and then followed by the other team member <coughs> okay so the font must be in the Times New Roman size 12 spacing 1.5 and the paragraph must be justified okay so the report content uh, the report itself should have the table of content this is just a common format of a report the first page must have the table of content uh, where you have the section titles and page numbers okay and then you should have the uh, introduction background of project include project title and instruction state and explain briefly the household furniture that you choose to improve okay so 
uh, make sure you take an original picture of your uh, reference furniture that you choose and then uh, you have to explain a little bit uh, what uh, the improvement that uh, you have to uh, do on the original furniture design okay and explain details why you choose to improve the design of the household furniture okay the third section okay you have to put the three sketches okay uh, make sure the uh, the sketch represent your uh, brainstorming ideas that you come out from your uh, group discussion okay make comparison of all three ideas okay you have to uh, compare each of the designs ideas that you discuss uh, and then you state the advantages and disadvantages of every ideas okay and then from that we know uh, that uh, which is the best ideas that you have to uh, choose okay the fourth section is final improve uh, furniture design 3d and dimension drawing so uh, based on that those three ideas that we that you have uh, discussed in the third section okay you have to draw a final 3d design uh, with suitable dimensions of the final chosen design so uh, you have an options uh, you can use the solidwood software to draw a final 3d design or maybe uh, if you want to draw a manual technical drawing all those drawings are based on your knowledge and your lessons uh, in this semester so uh, I know that all of you have uh, or already learned about the solid uh, words and technical drawing right so you have to use your knowledge okay uh, to uh, design in 3d uh, the, the the improvement of the furniture so uh, after that in the fifth section uh, all equipments and material used to build the furniture are listed so this is like a BOM a bill of materials uh, I think you have already learned about BOM in your technical drawing okay so uh, that list you have to put all the materials and equipments that uh, must be included in the designs okay and then after that uh, you have to conclude in a conclude sessions okay normally the conclusions are just a summary of the information that you have put in your report okay and then you also have to comment uh, to comment and compare on both observing the new de design of the furniture and the old or original uh, used designs okay and then finally uh, for every report we must have the references so you have to put the list of references or citations based on what uh, the information source that you use uh, during the uh, assignment to uh, progress okay so and then that's it for the report so if you put all of this you put a good content in your technical report here so maybe you can get 10 out of 10 percent okay and then let's go to the presentation parts okay each group member must involve during the 10 to 12 minutes English presentation using the Microsoft PowerPoint okay presentation consists of item below introduction brainstorming and design evaluation uh, final improve furniture design selection of materials and applied methods and conclusions okay so make sure you divide uh, the 10 or 12 minutes of that presentations by your numbers of group members so let's say you have five group members so make sure every one of the group member have to present uh, no more than two minutes and then uh, make sure you record uh, the presentation may you may be using the Google Meet or whatever software that you prefer 
yeah, and then you share to me or submit to me in the Google Classroom. Okay, uh, first uh, the PowerPoint file format, PTX I think, PPTX, and also the link to your video presentation video that you have recorded. Okay, so I need two files. One the PowerPoint file and the other one is the video file so if you submit those two files okay so inshallah you can get 10 out of 10 percent marks here for the presentation okay so here in uh, uh, the instruction uh, states that the submission should be on the 14th week so that is the final week of our semester right now okay so that's why i have decided that the deadline of our assignment 2 is on 20 january 2021 okay don't forget that deadline okay so i think that's all for this video if you have any other question or any problem just let me know just ask me in the whatsapp group okay okay Till the next video, uh, good luck and try hard. Uh, that's all. Assalamualaikum and bye bye.